Yo, what's going on? This D man bringing to you some more EA Sports UFC 4. Yo, for real, let me know if I should bring the old intros back. I've been looking at my UFC videos like they're missing something, bro. I don't know, man. I don't know. I think the intro is it. But today we're using Anderson Silva. Now, Anderson Silva had a fight yesterday against Uriah Hall. I was hoping that Anderson Silva won, but I chose Uriah Hall, bro. That, that's tough. Um, he's a legend. You know, if that was our last time seeing him fight in the UFC, just know that he is still a legend, no matter how his career is ending up. Spider slander is never allowed. So, man, it's sad seeing him fight like that and seeing him go out like that. It's even sadder using him on UFC 4. That chin stat is a lie. And it was tough. You know, it was definitely one of my tougher sessions. Uh, shed a little thud here, here and there, but... You know, we got some pretty good gameplay. First up, we have Spider versus a calf in the Kumite. We'll see what's up, man. Oh, a fake toucher this early? Bro, it's like 9 or 10 a.m. on a Sunday morning. And you and you out here like this. That's tough, man. In the comments below, let's discuss Anderson Silva and Uriah Hall. Or Anderson Silva in general. Give me your favorite fight. And also give me your favorite knockout from the spider. Of course, I know <laughs> Forrest Griffin would be up there for a lot of people. Because that's just demon time. Head kick. I need to... I really need to move my head, man. Get my, get my matrix on. I think when it comes to UFC 4, Anderson Silva might be the worst person for me to use. Mainly because I don't use head movement. I kind of walk in two shots. And also, I don't clinch. And we know Anderson Silva has a terrifying Muay Thai plum. So let's see what we can do, man. I did get hit with a fake touch. So I might have to sweat a little bit. Knees to the body, I'll take it. In that clinch, Anderson Silva does a lot of damage. Oh, let me move back. I really should have stiffed armed right there. It's all good. Now, Anderson Silva has a low takedown rate and his grappling stats aren't what they used to be. I mean, I remember, man, back in the day, bro, if you pick Anderson Silva online, it's no way you were losing. Now, when I pick Anderson Silva, it's like, uh, uh, I might be in trouble. It might be kind of tough. Like I know Anderson Silva right now is four stars, but correct me if I'm wrong. We don't have a legend Anderson Silva, do we? Did I overlook that? <laughs> I think we should have a super souped up Anderson Silva. Oh yeah, he he he's toast. He's lean with it rock with it he's cha cha sliding to the left and right bro that's not gonna do anything for you i only grapple with that man because he fate touched like bro I, i'm not even mad that you fate touched i'm mad that you fate touched at like 10 in the morning on sunday bro sunday dog the day after halloween you're not candy drunk or something come on man all right so we're in the backyard with michael bisping Shout out to Michael Bisping, man. He's a really good color commentator. Truth be told, I might like him more as a commentator than a fighter. <laughs> Let me see what this guy is on. What I need to do is um get another ranked episode in, but like I said, with next gen on the way. Ooh, that was heavy. Oh, that was heavy. Get your leg right, Anderson. Come on, man. Come on, man. We don't want to see that leg snap. Oh, chin. Hey, I've never slipped on Michael Bisping's hands, man. That's for sure. Drop him. Stall out a little bit. Hey, I swear that chin rating is a lie. Not too many people in middleweight have a 90 plus chin rating. But even then, man, if Anderson Silva gets touched once, Man, you might you might be in trouble. And it makes sense, right? Especially 2020, 2019 Anderson Silva, bruh. Man, he 
it's just sad to see. He's kind of brittle right now. He's not the silver that can take shots over and over again. That went out the window with Wyman. There we go. Hey, he he is faking those transitions like crazy, man. Relax. Look, 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 look. Here we go. Mini game time. Oh, maybe not. Let me be smart because if I don't do that, I might not see half guard again. Tough, tough. Another fake that got me. There we go. Look, look, look. Damn, boy. Hey, respect to you. You got me, man. I can handle two fakes, but not three. Oof. Oof. Caught him with the leg kick. I definitely need to kick more, but... Do I want to do the ass kick? Do I want to throw that out there? Do I want to throw the head kick out there? Okay, we landed. Let me get right, man. No good. Okay. Front kick landed. Two piece landed. Striking wise, Anderson Silva, like he's not bad at all on UFC 4, man. Not bad at all. I just know if I get touched, I'm in danger. That's how you end round one. All right, pretty good first round. I had to take him down to the ground. Kind of slow the fight down a little bit. Like I said, man, defensively, I'm not that good on UFC 4, man. So I need to just stall myself. Now, I do need to stiff arm retreat a lot more. Need to move my head a lot more for sure. I can't just barrel through everybody. Because then when I use people like, oh, go over him. Yes. No. Watch out for that. Because then when I use people like Anderson Silva, who doesn't have the best chin, man, I get exposed, don't I? Oof. Watch out for that. Heavy. Even on UFC 4, when Anderson throws a leg kick, I cringe a little bit. Mm. I just want to slow the fight down. We did damage, but like I said, if I get popped, there we go. Fall, fall, fall. Dive in there, Anderson. Let me see what your ground striking is like. His ground striking is money. For real. His ground striking is looking nice. I like it. All right, pretty good fight with Michael Bisping. Uh, Michael Bisping is somebody else that I have to use on UFC 4. I imagine he's pretty good, man. Has pretty good hands, so I'll try him out soon. We might be hanging in the middleweight division for a little bit. Man, this is a big calf right here. Got on the backyard. The Daisy Dukes. The chain. You know, I'm kind of with Marshall, man. If we get some real accessories like don't get me wrong as somebody that create calves I, I like all this stuff in the game i ain't gonna cap but if we can get some real like fighter accessories muay thai accessories boxing accessories that would be fire too man like tyson fury should be in there with with boxing gloves that would be hilarious in my opinion but i don't know at the end of the day it's really about gameplay so we can get that fixed first then accessories later. Roundhouse to the body. Oh, big uppercut. Ah. Fighting Southpaw is so tough for me. Uh oh. Let me take my time, man. There we go. Hook got through. Are you going to let Anderson Silva lead this dance? Shoot, may I have this dance? Don't mind if I do. 
It might be bait, though, so I'm taking my time. And just misses with that big right hand. Tried it with that overhand. And he landed the right hand there. Oof. Oh, that front kick, bro. Walked right into it. Caught him. Uppercut hook. Got through. Man, I might just I might just let the hands go. Hold on, man. Oh, he got the double leg. Tough. It's like he heard me, fam. I really want to let them hands go. We'll see what's up. That's <laughs> another front kick. Super tough. I have one too, man. Caught him. Man, he is trying me, bro. Real talk, the front kick is there, though, for him. I keep walking into it. Just like he's walking into that hook. And then he threw up the bird. All right, man. Hands time. Let the hands go, Anderson. Rewind the clock a little bit. Rewind it. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. He felt those. And I felt that, bro. He's going to keep trying it, huh? I knew it. I tried to get selfish. Not selfish, but greedy. I tried to get greedy. Man. Then he's going to put up a good fight. You're a funny guy. All right, bet. Let's see what we can do in round two with Anderson Silva, man. All right, all I really have to watch out for is that front kick. Let me get it going. Oh, there it is. Look, look, he's trying, bro. I have to move. But I know he wants that front kick. I just have to make him pay for it. Good overhand. Another overhand. He's trying, bro. Look, I know another one. I knew it, bro. He's one of those. <laughs> That's tough, man. You find something that works a few times and just and just spam it. I'm kind of like that with combos, though, so I really can't talk, huh? Let me get right. Nope. Stop playing with me. <laughs> Keep trying that overhand. I think my next video, bro, it needs to be no full guard finishes. He went for a submission instantly, bro. Shout out to D-Man's Corner. You see me rocking it. You see me rocking it. Not panicking. I might be panicking a little bit, but we're good. All right. D-Man's Corner. Y'all are always looking out for me, man. I appreciate you. I appreciate you a lot. Let me see if I can move before. Here he go, man. I think this is the most annoying thing, bro. He spams the same strikes on the feet. Now he's spamming submissions, bro. And it's funny because I know UFC 4 will let him have one. We're okay right now, but... I don't know, bro. I don't have a good feeling about this. I went the wrong way. With this mini game, I'm trying to be slow but fast at the same time. What the f does that mean, Kobe? I don't know. Got out of that easy. Man, let me get right, bro. Golly. Full guard. Was it able to do anything? I went. I'm going the right way. <laughs> it's not letting me stop it. That's tough. That's tough. Anderson Silva submission defense must be kind of kind of shaky. No, nah, actually, it might be pretty high, bro. It's just his his actual ground game. That's what it is. I'm getting out of the attempts pretty pretty easily. Stop it! I'm on that. There we go. Let me see what the ground striking is looking like. Yes, sir. All right, I'll take it, man. Real talk. I think. I don't know how I feel about Anderson Silva right now, man. I need to strike with them, bro. I need some 
I need some KOs and some TKOs, but at this point, I'm taking wins however I can get them, bro. One more week with PS4. We're just having fun right now, man. I think our next gen, I want to actually make content on UFC and not just drop gameplay, face cam, challenges, all of that. Let me know what you think if you made it this far. It's funny because when I play in middleweight, I try to avoid posting matches against Izzy too much. Let's see what we can do, man. It's still the Izzy division, though, man. He's running through this division right now. Just like Anderson used to run through it. Let me see if I can get some type of striking in. He's doing that stiff arm retreat, which is nice. Oh, man, get popped once and it's over with. That's Anderson Silva, bro. That's super tough. Too late on that counter. Couple shots landed. Big hook landed. Come on, Anderson. You're all right, bro. You'll be all right. I like to slip and throw that hook a lot. Oh, that was kind of beautiful, but I'm in hater mode right now. Hell nah. <laughs> that was a nice little combo he threw. Damn, bro. And really starting to make these shots count. Let me see what he's like. Crazy. Dang, nah, I need to stand up, bro. I've been kind of grappling all day. Stand us up, bro. Stand us up. We're good, man. We're good. We're good. Good push kick. I know, like, this video, it might look stupid because... Man, I haven't been using a Muay Thai at all, but I, I find it kind of cheesy if I keep clinching. You know what I mean? I find that super cheesy, so I don't want to keep doing that. Although I could, I don't want to, you know? I, I also, ooh, well, I also haven't been kicking enough. Spin kicks to the body. Like I said, Anderson Silva is a challenge for me because of his fight style. It's the, it's the complete opposite of my fight style, which is which is tough. Your hip toss. He probably wants to stand. I'm going to sit on that. Yes, sir. Well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. All right, I'm not going to backpack you. I'm going to need you, though. Hey, good knee, man. Overhand landed. There we go. A little striking from the spider. Rewinding the clock a little bit. Yo, imagine if that happened in real life. No way, not this. Not at this point in time, but just imagine. It looks good in your head, doesn't it? Real life a little bit different than UFC 4, though. Tough. Hey, man, I, Anderson Silva is a legend. I know I'm not the best with him on UFC 4, but he's fun to use. I promise you, he's still fun to use. My gameplay is so disgusting, bro. I can't keep winning with the full guard finish. It can't be just me, right? Like, every fight ends that way for me. Whether I win or lose, full guard finish. I don't know, bro, but I hope you all are good, man. Short video today. Not because it's Anderson, just the route I want to go. 30 minutes might be too long.